Hello everyone, welcome to this uh, video and uh, we are going to talk about alternating voltage uh, uh, and it is, uh, we are going through one example and we are going to draw a line, we have a G here and it is uh, going with I even from there and it is up there up there and it is to wire goes through and they are going to go there and they are going to cross there and they are going to cross section each other in that part and we have a magnetic field B and uh, the direction of this to this is alpha and uh, and this is B and uh, this is B cosinus alpha and this here is B Okay, uh, in this uh, we have a phi, the flow is B A cosinus omega T and uh, the phi the T equals to minus B A sinus omega T and E equals to N uh, the phi the T it is uh, n omega b a sinus omega t and uh, and we have a e equals to e hat sinus omega t and E hat equals to N omega B A. And in the same way we have I equals to I hat sinus omega T. U is U hat sinus omega T. And uh, which is R I and uh, U hat, it is R I hat uh, sinus omega T and U is R I. The effective values is uh, Ri2 is equals to Ri hat 2 divided by 2 and I equals to I hat divided by 2 squared and U also is U hat divided by U2 squared.
and also in uh, and we have also um, it was over a resistor over the inductance I I had sinus omega t you you had sinus omega t plus p hat and u is x l i which is omega l i I must. Example for that is uh, uh, we have a L L equals to minus twenty one Henry and uh, uh, it uh, lies in a uh, uh, alternative. Uh, the voltage uh, with the uh, I top equals to 74 milliampere and the frequency uh, F equals to 100 kilohertz. And uh, what is XL equals to 2PFL? This omega L is to be F. L, we put the values, we are going to 1319 ohm. And uh, what is the top uh, value of U equals to XLI top. And it is, uh, uh, we know about the I top and the uh, XL we calculated here and it is 98 volts and I equals to I top divided by uh, 2 squared and it is going to be 52 milliampere and the U, U equals to U equals to U top divided by Two squared, and it is sixty-nine ampere. Okay. Now we have the alternating. alternating uh, voltage in a uh, capacitance is I equals to I top sinus omega t U is U top sinus omega t minus P hal here is plus for inductance for capacitance is the minus and the U equals to XC I which is uh, I divided by omega C. Example is uh, we have C equals to 2.2 microfarad uh, and uh, the U is uh, 127 volts and the uh, F is 50 hertz. Uh, the XC equals to 1 divided by 2 PFC and the values is here and it's going to be 1,446 ohm. 
and u equals to xci then um, i equals to u divided by xc and it is uh, Uh, 88 milliampere and uh, sim q max q max equals to c u hat um, and u hat is uh, u u hat is u multiplied by uh, 2 squared. It is uh, c 2.2 10 minus 6 multiplied by u 127 2 squared. And it is 0.4 milli column. Now we are going through Now we are going to do um, alternating uh, current or uh, voltage over uh, resist resistance and uh, and uh, inductance. And we have uh, UR and UL, and it is U. It is U, and we have a V, and we have a I. Then U R is R I. U L is omega L I, and U equals to I squared R two plus omega L over by two. Example, we have U equals to 220 volt, F is 50 hertz, and uh, L is 0.3 Henry, and R is 40 ohm. Uh, we will know about the I equals to U divided by R2 plus 2PF L power by 2. We put the values and we are going to get a I equals to 2.15 ampere. And uh, and we are going to have a phi. Phi is arctan U L divided by U R. It is uh, omega L divided by R. We have all the values and L two P F two P F L divided by R. We have all those values and we put it here and find the phi. It is 
67 degrees. Okay, we have a inductance and a resistance in series to a generator and then total R, R is 21 ohm and UR equals to 12 volt, 12 volt. In uh, that moment, the voltage over uh, twin generator is zero. Uh, what is the UL then? Because the uh, U total is zero, then U, which is UR plus UL it is steady, then UL equals to minus UR equals to minus 12 volt. And I equals to UR divided by R. It is 12 divided by 21. It is zero fifty-seven ampere. The alternating uh, uh, voltage is over. Uh, uh, resistor and the uh, 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 capacitance. It is I and U R, and it is U C one divided by omega C, and this is U. Uh, is R I. And it is the Z I and U R is R I and the U C uh, is I divided by omega C and the Z equals to uh, R power by 2 plus 1 divided by omega C power by 2 and U equals to I Z. Now we have an example. A capacitor is in a series with the resistance R is 30 ohm and the uh, U is 4 volt and the uh, F is 1 kilohertz and the uh, I is 104 milliampere. Uh, we will uh, zeta. Zeta is uh, equals to U divided by I. 4 divided by 104 is 38.5 uh, ohm. 
and uh, uh, as uh, x c x c equals to one divided by omega c and uh, it is also zeta 2 minus r2 squared we put the values we are getting that xc equals to 24.1 oh and the uh, c equals to xc omega 2pf omega uh, xc to pf xc and it is uh, 6.6 micro farad and the uh, phi the wing uh, the the phi arc phi equals to arc tan xc divided by r it is 38.8 degree The effect, the effect P equals to Ri2, PL, PR, PL is 0, PC is 0, and P equals to UI cosinus phi. We have uh, equipment, U is 220 volt, and uh, P equals to 500 watt, and the uh, cosinus phi equals to 0 0.8. What is the I? Uh, I is from here, I is P divided by U cosinus phi, the value put in is 2.8 ampere. And uh, how many uh, energy we have uh, consumed? W is Pt, it is uh, 0 0.5. It is watt, it is kilowatt, and multiple by 24 hours. It is 12 kilowatt hour. Another example is uh, we have a uh, resistance and a Capacitance uh, in series and the U, U equals to 127 volt and I is 0 0.97 ampere uh, and then uh, P equals to 52 W. Uh, the resistance uh, zeta uh, P equals to Ri2, then uh, R 
equals to P divided by I2, it is 55 ohm. And uh, the UR equals to RI, it is 53 volt. And the uh, cosinus phi uh, equals to from this P divided by U R I and it is uh, fifty two divided by one hundred twenty seven multiplied by zero ninety seven and it is zero forty two uh, is the value. Okay, it was all in this thing and uh, we are ready with the physics before the university level and uh, thank you for watching. See you in Shemi.